Yeah, no, I think that I think we've definitely, you know, grown more accustomed to being comfortable in both kind of lineups. You know, we've been kind of starting small and then Ryan will come in for me usually first and then we'll go big for part of the game and that's what we've kind of been doing in practice as well. And I think that's gone I think that's gone well. Um, you know, having the two bigs in there creates a mismatch for most teams on the inside and then having the four guards, obviously somebody with like the quickness of Joe T being at the one and then, you know, me being at the four, you know, we got we have like a better perimeter better perimeter uh, kind of lineup out there. So I think that there's you know, it's been working, I think it will continue to. What about the challenge of making big shots at the end? He's done so much of that for you guys. Do you think you'd see that being more of a group effort with the number of guys willing to do that? Yeah, I think so. I think it's definitely going to come down to, um, you know, I think guys will step up. I mean, Weezy's made big shots. Mm -hmm. You know, I think he'll be somebody that we'll look to. You know, Lucas made big shots. I've made some big shots. You know, I think CJ will step in, and CJ's made CJ made the big shot against Texas Tech. Um, you know, so I think that there's definitely guys that are going to be able to step up, but we'll we'll definitely miss them in that role. You guys knew that this was a good chance of happening. Has that made the the, the, the news <coughs> or the transition easier that you kind of could see that it might be coming? Yeah, yeah, definitely. You know, we we kind of suspected it, I think, um, and you know, we knew we knew kind of what he was dealing with and what he was going through, the pain he was in. So him having you know having to make this decision you know I don't think it really surprised everyone a ton maybe at, you know as much as it would have you know otherwise